HTML Favicam. A Favicam is a small image displayed next to the page title in the browser tab. How to add a Favicam in HTML? You can use any image you like as your Favicam. You can also create your own Favicam on sites like uh, HTTPS colon double forward slash uh, uh, www.favicam.cc So you can check out this this page if you want to create some Favicams. A Favicam is a small image, so it should be a simple image with high contrast. A Favicam image is displayed to the left of the page title in the browser tab like this. So for example, the W3 schools have this W3 as the Favicam. The Favicam.cc has this image, AFCC as the Favicam. If we go to Google, we're gonna have this this G inside of the circle as the Favicam. Okay, so to add a Favicam to your website, either save your Favicam image to the root directory of your web server or create a folder in the root directory called images and save your Favicam image in this folder. A common name for a Favicam image is favicam.ico. Next, add the link element to your index.html file after the title element. Uh, here they've given us an example how to do it, so we're gonna open Visual Studio Code and we're gonna create a file name. I'm gonna name it test uh, or let's name it index.html. So let's it's gonna be index.html. I'm gonna press shift exclamation mark, then we press enter, and now we're gonna grab the title and the link. So I'm gonna grab it. And I'm gonna go here, it has to be in the head. So I'm gonna save it. And now we have lines nine and ten. In number nine, we have the title, it's gonna be just my page title. But in number ten, we have the link tag. And inside of that, we have the rel. And if you mouse over it, uh, you have some information here, for example. This attribute names a relationship of the link document to the current document. The attribute must be a space separated list of the link type values. And then equal sign inside of the double quotes, we have the icon. Then we have the type attribute, equal sign. And this is gonna be a description. Uh, here we have the image slash X hyphen icon. Finally, we're gonna have the href attribute. And this is where it's gonna point where our image is located. So here it says that our file favicam.ico is located in the folder images. So here I have some images for the previous uh, previous videos that we saw. Uh, so I have a folder name images and inside of that I have this HTML file that give. So all, the, all of these pictures are from uh, W3 school. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna delete this part. So it's gonna be equal sign and then double quotes. So now I'm gonna press forward slash. And from here I can pick any image that I want. For example, let's go with uh, images. And let's pick this one. Okay, so, okay. I'm gonna press enter and I'm gonna save it now. So I'm gonna open with, open with live server. And now we have this Favicam, this kind of like a orange uh, HTML5. This one is my Favicam right now. But for example, we can change it. Let's say instead of images, I go just press forward slash and I pick, I don't know, I pick um, this one. Let's see what happens. It's gonna be image chainia. It's gonna be this one, it's gonna be here. So this one is gonna be my Favicam. If I go here, as you can see it, this is our Favicam now. So let's try with the, I don't know, just for, forward slash and now let's pick, I don't know, this one. We save it and it's gonna be, okay, this is our Favicam, it's gonna be the, this one. 
and all these images I already have it from from a previous uh, project and all of those peaks are from W3 schools so that is the that is how it works uh, now save the index.html file and reload it in your browser your browser tab should now display our favicam image to the left of the page title as you can see here so in this case this is our favicam favicam uh, file format supports uh, the following table shows the file format support for a favicam image so we have the browser, the ICO, the PNG, the GIF, the JPG, the SVG. So in the browser we have the edge, ICO, JS, PNG, JS, GIF, JS, JPG, JS, SV, SVG, JS. So all of the browsers, Edge, Chrome, Firefox, Opera, Safari, and they, they are all they are, they are going to support it. So they're gonna support ICO, PNG, GIF, JPG, and SVG. So the chapter summary: use the HTML link element to insert a favicam, and we have the HTML link tag, the link tag that defines the relationship between a document and an external resource.